Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 28th. Okay, so we're just gonna see what comes up. You know, the timing is fluid, right? So, yeah, me and my souls, I always say so. I've been saying it for years. Two of swords, two of swords torn. We got somebody here that is torn. They're torn between two directions. They don't know which way to go. They got like some sort of double loyalty, right? It's like one hand they want to go this way and the other hand they want to go the other. They need to make a painful, stressful decision. It's about honoring the truth. We're having somebody that has in, been in some state of denial, not really wanting to accept the truth, but they need to. Okay, they need to be honest with themselves. Somebody's been blocking their emotions. They've been avoiding the truth. And now they're torn. Now they're torn. It's like, oh no. Four of Pentacles. Now the Four of Pentacles is obsessed with working, money, stability, uh, holding on. We could have somebody here that is very, very stubborn. Resisting change, you know, this person doesn't like to open up, doesn't like to let go. Once they have something, you know, they don't like to let go of things. Um, hard worker. So we definitely have somebody here that focuses on their job. They bury their emotions and their work and their job, okay? They just, I'm going to work my life away and then I don't have to deal with this, you know. I can, I can just continue to block. I can block my feelings, I can block my emotions and bury myself in my work, in my job and focus on my financial stability and, and just, you know, pretend that everything is good. It's not. Yeah, we got a workaholic here, somebody that work, 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 and they're doing it, one, for the money, but two, for the ability to not have to think about things and just that way it does, it protects their heart, you know. You know, I don't have to, I don't have to engage my heart if I'm working. So I feel like somebody is needing to face their fears. They're torn between maybe two relationships. Maybe, and, and one of them may be a job and a love or between two lovers or something like that. Somebody has to make a painful, stressful decision here. Ooh, we got a Queen of Pentacles over here. This Queen of Pentacles, she has a golden opportunity. She's solid. She's nurturing. She's caring. She's generous. She looks like this one has some, uh, well, she's abundant as well. Okay. And she looks, if you see roses, she's, she may be looking for love. Okay. She's, she's looking for romance. Um, this Queen of Pentacles is very grounded. She's stable. She has a lot to offer. I mean, that's a huge pentacle in her hand. That's a huge opportunity. She's very stable. She is, she's plenty. She's not lacking. Okay. I mean, she's not. This Queen of Pentacles, she's very, she's very motherly. She's very caring. Um, abundant. Responsible. Mm. Now we got somebody here that is making progress. There is progress that is being made. They're holding on to something that is stable. But it looks like they're moving away from it. They're moving away from something. And they may be putting in effort towards something that is more heartfelt. Somebody, it feels like we have, we because this is a choice, it's a decision. I feel like we have an individual that has been holding on to somebody for stability. You know, for the for some sort of stability. Just that there's no love right there. It's all about stability. This is some, when you get the king of swords in reverse, it could be somebody that is, you know, using their heart instead of their head. You know, going with their heart thinking while they're at work, thinking about what their heart wants, starting to soften up. Somebody may be starting to soften up a little bit. Um, the six of swans is, is somebody who doesn't want to fight, you know, done fighting, done with the competition. Uh, it's victory after sorrow. So maybe choosing to let go of somebody that they've been holding on to for stability. So somebody maybe because that's a choice, somebody is choosing 
to stop fighting, to stop um, competing. It's over. The battle is over. Uh, they were holding on to somebody for financial stability or just stability. Even if it wasn't financial stability. Maybe this person is a homemaker. I mean, you get the Queen of Pentacles. I know exactly who she is. Okay, she cleans the house. She does the cooking. She does the shopping. She does, she's, okay, think about it this way. I was thinking about it this morning, as a matter of fact. You know, how I was thinking of how I like my man. Okay, so I'm just going to tell you. I happen to be the Queen of Pentacles slash Queen of Swords. I like my man to do everything outside. Okay, he works outside. I do everything in the house. That's the way it goes. Okay, and that's how it is. So, that's what we got here. So somebody I feel like has been holding on to somebody that, you know, is stable, is secure, that does all the homey stuff. It's funny that that came into my head today. I'm not looking for a man. I don't know why that came into my head. Interesting. Anyhow, um, six of wands. Six of Wands. Now that is victory. It's progress. It's somebody that is progressing forward. They're moving away. They are because sixes are traveling. They are. Somebody is moving away from holding on to something just for the stability of it. You know? And they're moving in another direction. And I feel like what they're doing is they're going, they're, they're ready for something more. Whatever that means. Oh, oh, wish star. Now this is being recognized. This is I'm, I'm, there could be famous. This is the, both of these cards represent fame, okay, and public recognition. So somebody may be looking for some but something more. You know, where they'll be recognized. You know, which is interesting because this is fame. This is a star. There's some sort of public recognition here. There's, this is a, this, I don't know if we have a star here or somebody that is famous. Somebody's work may be famous. We have a, we have, this is, a, this is like a hero. Okay. This is, this is somebody who has fought a battle, has been through a battle. The battle is over. It looks like we got a little bit of indecision here, though, because that's, that the choice needs to be made. But this is the battle. There's the, but usually, you know, the Six of Wands is the battle is over. The fight is over. This person is looking at wish fulfillment, looking at happiness, looking at renewal, looking at something beautiful, looking at, I don't know, a star? Because this is a star. Somebody may be hoping for renewal. You know, they're hoping, hoping and praying because this is prayers being answered. It is. This is unexpected help arriving as well. This is a blessing. Blessed. Somebody may be blessed. They may be blessed with another chance or something like that. But this guy has is a fighter. He has to fight for what he wants. And he knows how to fight for what he wants. So we may have a fighter that is going after, you know, something very beautiful. His wish fulfillment. After holding on to something just for stability. Wanting to put in effort. Following the heart instead of being cold. But I feel like there's been some sort of emotional withdrawal for sure. There has. Strength. Strength. Courage. Brave. Bravery. We have somebody here that is going to be brave. They are very brave. They're very courageous. They, they have a strong attraction to somebody. They're highly attracted to somebody. This person shines. You know, famous. I don't know where this famous keeps coming up from. Um, maybe an actress. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. 
victory. We have a victory here. Somebody is going to be victorious. And it could be a work. It could be a job. Somebody could get a new job uh, that makes them famous. I don't know where that just came from. Maybe it's an actress job. Oh, boy. Somebody may get a job, you know, an offer. I don't know where that's coming from to, to do some sort of acting and it makes them famous. There's healing here. The star and the strength card are both healing. They're both healing energies. So there's healing. There's, there's an opportunity to heal something on this day. I think we have somebody coming in. This is, this is somebody that is noble. Okay. This is somebody who is done fighting. They're doing something noble. Okay. And they're headed towards wish fulfillment. They're headed towards something very, very beautiful, whatever that means. This is somebody that is, you know, not letting fear get in the way. They're not. This person is fearless. They're, they've been in some sort of emotional turmoil, blocking their feelings, but now it's like they're not going to let fear get in the way. They're ready. They're ready to move forward. They're ready to put in effort. They're ready for a new job or they're ready for happiness. They're ready for wish fulfillment because the star card is wish fulfillment and they're hoping for renewal of some sort. Healing. Um, there's definitely a lot of beauty here too. So somebody is, is really, uh, beautiful, uh, vibrating, shining, shining very, very much, um, vibrating at a very high level. I feel like we have an individual that with that King of Swords reverse that hasn't been following their heart. You know, they've been cold. They've been, uh, not communicating. I feel like they're going to be communicating. They're going to be putting in effort um, after being closed off. You know, it's like they find this strength to do so or something like that. Um, there's guaranteed success here with these two cards. Putting in effort guarantees success. This is guaranteed success. Stability, money, a lot of money. So we have somebody here that may be getting an offer. I don't know if it's a job offer that, or I don't know what the hell this is, but it's, a, it's, a, it's money, a lot of money. A message is coming, or messages, good news is coming. That's news arriving, back and forth, messages back and forth. There is going to be some messages back and forth with somebody that wants to, I don't know, they want to work with you, or they want to work something out, or something like that. That's six of wands, that is, that is, that is a, somebody that is, is, uh, Wow, it's a savior of some sort. It's a hero. This person is a warrior, you know. He's already fought. He's already fought a big fight. He's very experienced, very knowledgeable. This is a winner. I feel like there's going to be some public recognition as well. It's like th th this person may be being urged urge to communicate because this is communication urge to go 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 do it it's like go do it go after that you know what I mean somebody's being told it's like they're because usually there's people in this card telling them go do it go do it go do it the time is now the time is now go do it and there is the time is now with these eights eight 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 the time is now right now do it now this is an opportunity for wish fulfillment. Fulfillment. It even may even, it may even be an opportunity to be. I don't know if it's famous because a star. You think about a star, the fame. It 
to get recognized. Somebody's being recognized. They're being recognized for their hard work. Put it that way. In their beauty or something like that. So anyhow, uh, and I do feel like there is a lot of money coming. Take a look at that. That is money, 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 money. A lot of money. Abundance, extreme abundance. And it's funny because when I did, I had this, I did, started out with this. We had the first card out was Blossoming Abundance. I already did one. I already did one reading. And I might, I might share it. But it was Blossoming Abundance. So we do have Blossoming Abundance. This is having it all. This is like uh, plenty of money. An abundance of money. Long-term success. Financial success. Permanent. This is property. Prosperity. Starting a family. Starting a business. Combining. Combining uh, resources. Family money. Uh, building up financial success together with somebody. Whatever this is, it's big, there's big money. There's an opportunity to have long-term financial success with somebody, but the hindrance is making a choice. That's the problem. There's going to be a painful, stressful decision that needs to be made first. You're going to have to choose. This is a new path. You may have to let go of something that isn't as stable to get this long-term success to get all this abundance i mean that looks like a friggin mansion it does so this is having it all there's a chance to have it all but you have to choose you have to choose to put in effort Somebody has to choose to put in effort and, and, and ask for it, but you can't you can't just ask for it. You're gonna do something about it. This is do something about it. You gotta fight for it. That is fight for it. Anyway, there is some some sort of good news coming in. It is a offer. An offer is coming in. It could lead to uh, financial abundance. Good luck. 